Hello everyone and welcome back to The Great Book of Grudges. My name is Nathan and we're back with another Total War Warhammer video. Today we're going to do something a little bit different. You see, Total War and modding go hand in hand, with many people preferring a modern experience to a vanilla playthrough. And who can blame them when you have such talented modders in the Total War Warhammer community such as Kataf with his Southern Realms mod, Mixu with his Legendary Lords, among many others. But there are others who are not so well known but do deserve a lot more notice. Which is why we've decided to come up with this series highlighting some lesser known modders who are doing amazing work. So today we're going to be looking at Chaos Robbie, a modder who's specialising currently in bringing in very famously known units and mounts into Total War Warhammer. Just to name a few of his mods that are already live, he's already successfully modded in the Celestial Hurricanum, a much requested Empire Magical War Machine, the Marienburg Landship, which was a stupidly expensive model back then in the days of the tabletop, which is why it was so rare to actually see it, and the actually quite surprisingly popular Chimera Rat. Chaos Robbie has a decent amount of unique mods already live on the Steam Workshop around 12 I believe at the time of recording this video and he posts on his own YouTube channel showing off some in-work development progress. By far the most impressive to me personally are that of the development videos of the Dwarf Shield Bearers and the Lothan Skycutter, and that of some mods which are already completed. I'm gonna highlight a few clips of different mod videos he's posted on this video so that way you can see exactly how much work he puts into it. Honestly, it shows that Chaos Robbie is a very talented modder and does deserve a lot more notice. The units he's creating in his mod series were very extremely popular in the days of the tabletop, and seeing as it's still unknown if we're ever going to get these units implemented in an official manner or not, modders such as Chaos Robbie are making sure that people's fan favourites end up in the game. I'll have links in the description below linking up to Chaos Robbie's YouTube account and to his workshop collection. And just a quick note here, there's already a number of sub mods to the already live mods, so that means that players who are fans of the SFO series can also use them there. Yes, you heard me, they're SFO compatible. Absolutely fantastic. I honestly suggest you check out Chaos Robbie's mods. Give a slightly lesser known modder a bit of a leg up, especially with this potential. But with that, my friends, we've come to the end of our video. Thank you so much for watching. If you did enjoy the video, might I suggest giving the video a like or even subscribing to the channel as it really does help us out. In the description section below are various different links to social media platforms such as Facebook, Instagram and Discord where you can get in contact with the Great Book team. Also in the description section below is an affiliate link with Element Games where you can buy loads of hobby based products, not just Warhammer, for 10 to 25% off. Making a purchase using our special link and also using our special code, both of which are in the description below, supports the channel at no extra cost to you, which we think is rather cool. A big thank you to our patrons, your support means the world to us. Honestly, it's amazing that people want to help a small channel like us grow and get to a higher level of content. A special thank you to our patrons, Gibraltar LUSC and Ryan Birch for subscribing to us at our fame level. Honestly, you guys are super cool. And a big thank you to our patron, Edward Huell, for subscribing to us at our king level. Mate, you're super awesome. But with that, my friends, thank you so much for watching once again, and we shall see you all again very, very soon. 
Have a good day.